So this is about all our profile related activities, how to update my profile, have it tap onto the view profile. So once you tap onto the view profile, you will get your profile details on here. I'm using a profile details called, you know, Thomas Selby, and he's a team leader of iPhone project. He's in the action at the moment. He's working right now. And Thomas manager is, you know, Logan McNeil, and his location is New York, US. And this is all about his education details. And this is, you know, feedback related blog that, you know, anyone can give the feedback to in the entire organizations to the Thomas. This is the Thomas job work history. And you can able to see the full details of the Thomas on below. His employee is 25074. And this is all about his designation related business title. And he is coming to that. He's a regular employee on here. On below that, you can able to see. On below that, you can able to see his complete details like when he was being hired, he's hired on 05-25-2021 and it will going to be counted system automatically. It's a one year, four months, four days. And below you can able to see his contact information, his organization, working related address activities. Have a tap on to the overview, you can able to identify his pay and compensation related details on here and the compensation details so people can able to identify on here he's receiving a compensation per annum approximately you know along with his salary up to seven lakhs okay on below that you can able to see what are all compensations he is receiving from the organization and the organization name would be the salary credit is it's an global modern services sa france 0407 is the organization code and com coming to the below you can able to see what are all compensation he was being taken so far the dates related available data plan related types allowance plan he received it and, and monthly he received from the organization so far coming to the pay related activities how to download the pay slip so we can open directly to our profile and in that we need to go to the pay tab once we enter into the pay tab we will go to pay slip blogger on here once we enter to this option we will get a couple of options to download our pay slip see we will receive this go to these three dots these three dots we will call it as an actions okay in workday language so we need to enter into these three dots we will get an actions fields in this action field you need to go here and export to your pay slip from here and since this is a training tenant you know we did receive the exact you know pay slip format into this data sheet okay but ongoing i will share you how to create a pay slip Along with this activation, we have some session those related activities in the ongoing sessions under the process of you know related to the active calculation fields. We can able to discuss related to the payslip activities on same. This is where we can able to download our payslips and we can check the you know taxes related detections from the organization under the tax selections and we can download the taxes related detections documents from the taxes documents blogger no current documents as of now it's was been available go to the job you can see the complete your leave balance in your current organization these are all the details you can have an export to this file from here download it from here 
tap to open up your folder you know you can able to see your complete leave balance related details enter here how many leaves you have and when you're supposed to be take these all leaves and what are all procedure you're supposed to take the leaves those details will be uploaded on here okay and next to that your job details current job designation related activities and your location related details it was been updated on here i'll just give a little brief about this you know table this is your start date of your joining date to the organization and your current position and your organization name and your location your pay rate type has been whether it was been inr or usd or pounds or you know dinar something like that it will show you your shortcut of you know pay rate currency fte means full time employee we having at 100% and weekly login hours we need to maintain 40 hours to the organization from monday to friday and the total salary allowance included we are receiving to the ctc is 328000 usd coming to the compensation block whatever the compensations you receiving from the organization those compensation related informations we have received from here these details we will discuss go to the benefits related activities if any benefits was organization providing to you on specified you know department or you know specified employees those related benefits points will be updated here as of now no benefits has been updated that's why it's showing as an empty and coming to the below you can able to see the personal details of the employee okay the personal information of the employee gender details date of birth age marriage status and which city is based on from those are all details we can able to identify on here and you can see the his personal vaccination details and you know vacation details and documentation details on here coming to the contact related information you can find his organization contact re related information along with the address and you can see his home related information and along with the address those related mobile number and details will be appear on here his contact details email ids home address organization address will be captured in this contact information coming to if you want his performance related activity you can able to see here his performance related go with performance review as of now no data has been available but i'll show you wait i'll pick up any of the other employee alex grossman is one of the employee you know test employee which we created to this employee recently to give him more understanding coming to the performance you can see his performance related reviews on here review of the employee start date and the end date you can have a manager rating of related details if you want to view any of this yearly basis of review have a tap on to the view you will get the complete information of the employee of his performance related activity related details clear if you want to download it have a tap on to here pdf and you can have a tap to <gasps> excuse me tap to okay from here you can export his details to as an pdf yes so go to the career you can see your career related performance in the current organization employee talent analysis 
Here we given a little symbolic related details and the information. The current rating of the employees out of five is four and retention is green color is in the safe zone and talent placement that will be decided from the operations not as an birthday consultant ourselves. If you want to export this file, you can have an export and you can check the complete details from here and download it. If you want to check his absent related activities, his leave balance related activities, have a tap on to the absence and balance. You will get complete balance of the employee absent details. This is unit of time, number of days he was being absented, being of a year balance and carry forwarding balance. This is all related information we will cover up once we are going to cover the staffing module. So this is all we can able to track into the staffing movements and I will show you how this carry forward eight years will be going to be and leave balances and how to apply the leave related activities. The current month of you know absence request you can able to check into this. So you was being completely taken for you know Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Monday and you was mentioned is an vacation hours that you took an permission from your organization and those those absence was being converted to has an personal leaves and your overall leave balances you can able to identify from here these are all your leave balance details and the plan details when you're supposed to be taken and used and you can have an export the file if you wanted and you can download it and you can able to watch has an observe it. This is all about your individual view and performance related activity. So if anyone having any questions that some sequence, I did not understand anything, something like that. Hope your silence is no. I'll go with the next one. So this is the team you can able to identify. Okay, just have a tap on to the team. So you can check the current team of yours. This is completely your team related activities. This all people was being looped to you along with you, whatever the, your regular activities on your organization, these people will be included to you working on the same. This is your organization chart map. Come to the main menu. go to the profile and next to that you people can find my account if you tap onto the my account whenever you would like to change of your password you can have a tap onto the change of your password immediately you people will receive the three options right now i'm not doing that option why because i'm using an server okay if i do that option whomsoever the students who has been connected and looping to me they will get blocked for next four to 24 hours so I'll show you in the notepad. Once you tap on to the password change, how it will be looked. First, it will ask you. Enter your current password. And second. Third, password, okay. Old password I'm just mentioning here. 
some x y z at numerical one two three new password i'm entering x y z at three two one so post entering our three bloggers you can have an option called tap to okay and submit once you submitted immediately the password has been going to change whatever the new password was being updated once you change your password unfortunately if you forgot at your password you can reset your password the reset of password you need to go with your team leader you need to raise a request through your outlook whatever the email facility is your organization providing you that you need to enter your you need to give your details and your error screenshot of your login page and immediately your team leader is going to be and reset your password and he will going to share you your new password to you on the same Go to the next one. Workbench. What is mean by workbench? Workbench is a purely related and business process activities. If any project is coming to our organization newly, we need to capture the complete business process activities. This business process activities was going to be and captured and covered in the business process related activities. And coming to the next option would be come to the main menu. Go to the sitemap. What is mean by sitemap? Sitemap is all about, you know, uh, it's a purely related to your organization, individual departments, individual employee, relate, report related data. Options will be available over there. I'll show you. Okay. So these all, you know, departments of your individual organization or in within your organization this is all like your, you know, your individual departments. If you want to check any of the report related activity, take it as an example. You want to check the compensation related activities. You have approximately, you know, 122 compensation report within your organization. And you can check which compensation you would like to check. I want to check my bonus plan. Have a tap on to the bonus plan related activities and select your bonus plan related all plans. I'm just selecting some XYZ plan name, tapping on OK. And I can download it, you know, this complete, you know, compensation bonus plan related details on here it's an 2000 usd bonus plan related where organization running this compensation to us and the plan name would be a triple a bonus plan okay just tap on to the explore and download it from here open up in detail you can have a view post your work. view has been completed you can Close it on the same. Come to the main menu. This is how we need to use the sitemap related activities, guys.